Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel Microbiology Easy Notes. If you like this channel, please like, subscribe, comment and share today's topic Spore Staining. Bacterial spore is different from bacterial cell. Spore staining is a microbiological technique used to visualize and differentiate bacterial and spore from vegetative cell. Please watch the video on bacterial spore to know the structure, formation and characteristics of spore. Link is displaying above. I will provide it in description box below too. So to stain the spore, specialized staining techniques are employed which make spores visible under the microscope. Most common methods for spore staining are Schaeffer full tone method and Donner method. Schaeffer full tone method. It is the most widely used technique for endospore staining. The technique was first described by Alice B. Schaeffer and McDonald Fulton in the 1930s. The method utilizes malachite green as the primary stain and saffronin as the counter stain. What is the principle behind Schaeffer Fulton method? Bacterial spore is a highly resistant, impermeable, and multi layered structure. Therefore, it is difficult for normal stains to penetrate and stain the spore wall. In Schaeffer Fulton method, steamed heat is applied to make spore wall softer and permeable for malachite green stain. The stain penetrates the endospore and is trapped in it. In this technique, heating acts as a mordant to facilitate the uptake of the stain. Once the endospore absorbs the stain, it is not removed by subsequent washing with decolorizing agents or water. When counter stained with saffronin, the vegetative cell takes the color of saffronin and appears red or pink, while endospore rejects the saffronin stain and appears green. Method of Schaeffer Fulton Staining a bacterial culture containing both vegetative cells and spores is sprayed onto a glass slide and allowed to air dry. To fix the cells to the slide, the slide is gently heated, which also helps in killing vegetative cells and making the spores more accessible to the staining. Malachite green is applied to the heat fixed smear. The slide is then heated over boiling water for 5 minutes to allow the malachite green to penetrate the spores. After heating with malachite green, the slide is rinsed with water for 30 seconds to remove excess stain. Saffronin is applied to the slide to stain any remaining vegetative cells. Now slide is again washed with water to remove excess stain. Slide is gently pet dried by using blotting paper. After that, smear is covered with one drop of immersion oil and examined under microscope. Observation is endospore will appear as green structure while vegetative cells will appear pink or red due to the saffronin counter stain. Donner's method. Donner's method is an alternative method for staining the endospores published by Donner in 1922. This method utilizes carbol fusion as a primary stain, acid alcohol as a decolorizer and negrosin as counter stain. Principle of Donner method. In this method also, steam heat is applied which softens the spore wall and carbon fusions gets into it and entrapped. When decolorized with acid alcohol, spore does not release the stain. However, color washes off from the vegetative cells. At this stage, spore appear red and cells appear colorless. When counter stain negrosin is applied, bacterial cells do not easily take up the counter stain because cell and negrosin both are negatively charged. At this point, negrosin stain the background. Therefore, vegetative cells appear colorless and spore appear red in the black background. Procedure for Donner's method. Make a smear on a clean glass slide. Allow the slide to dry and then heat fix. Cover the smear with carbon fusion and heat the slide over boiling water for about 5 minutes. After cooling it down, wash the slide with acid alcohol for about a minute to decolorize and then rinse with tap water. Add a drop of negrosin to the smear to form a thin film. Allow the slide to dry. Observe under the microscope using immersion oil. There are other methods of spore staining also like modified Jean Nelson method where primary stain is carbon fusion 
decolorized as 0.25 to 0.5 percent sulfuric acid then counter stain is leo for methylene blue and in this method spore appear red and bacteria appear blue second method is wartlow mu and mitwer method in this method primary stain is malachite green decolorizer is water counter stain is saffron and the interpretation is spores appear green vegetative cells appear pink or red next method is abort method where primary stain is methylene blue decolorizer is acid alcohol and counter stain is aniline fusion in this method spores appear blue and bacteria appear red next method is molar stain in this method primary stain is carbon fusion and decolorizer is acidified ethanol and counter stain is methylene blue the interpretation of this method is spores appear red and bacteria appear blue next method is modified molar stain in this method primary stain is kinyun's carbon fusion decolorizer is 2% sulfuric acid and 80% ethanol counter stain is lofler methylene blue interpretation of this method is spores appear red and bacteria appear blue